<clears throat> Shalom and Makim, your brother Kanan, back at you with the truth. Start by giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashim, Yahweh Shine, Ba'ashim, Rakakadash. Double honor and respect go to the apostles and elders of great millstone who well and teach well in Israel by being example to this day. Peace and salutation go to the elect, teaching and preaching the truth and his righteousness, purity and sincerity, and waiting on Yahweh Shine, the Lord, and call Jesus Christ for salvation. Shalom, Makim. All right, um, gonna make this real quick hit. All right, uh, just gonna let uh, hey brothers, you, know, you alone in this thing, you know, and and that's something uh, you have to understand in this truth. All right, we alone in this thing. All right, all right. Your family's not gonna hear you. Your uh, wives, friends, whoever, not gonna hear you. But Yahweh Shimon Shine is going to hear you. You're alone in this truth, man. You have the all you have, all we have is the brotherhood and Yahweh Shimon Shine. That's it, okay? All right. Because when it comes when it comes down down to that persecution, right? Oh, uh, oh, oh, for sure they're going to be persecuting us. All right. The, the first ones that's going to be ratting you out is your papa and your mama. All right. They're going to be the first ones to rat you out. And uh, sell you out to the, uh, the authorities. You're alone in this thing, okay? All right? Just have that imagination. That have that imagination that Yahweh Shemal Shai is dealing with you. You see Yahweh Shemal Shai is with you. All right? You gotta uh, cast off this world. Fuck this world. All right? These these people was never with us from the beginning. Okay? Your women. Your women is not your women. All right? Okay? You're alone in this thing. All right? So that's why you got to keep the gold, gold to ourselves. All right? Hit that gold in a secret spot where nobody can find it. Meaning hit, hide this truth and deep in your mind when you're out in the world, man. Okay? I'm just going to read a, a, a few scriptures and uh, close it out. And it says... <clears throat> Book of Matthew chapter 19. Um, I had it too. Give me a give me a moment. Oh, here we go. Matthew 28. Uh, Matthew 28. Uh, not Matthew 19 and 28. Book of Matthew chapter 19, verse 28. And Yahweh Shai said unto them, Verily I say unto you that ye which have followed me in the regeneration of the Son of Man shall sit in the throne of his glory, and ye shall sit upon twelve thrones, judging the twelve tribes of Israel. And that's our goal, right? To sit upon the thrones. All right, with Yahweh Shai, okay, judging the uh, judging the twelve tribes of Israel. All right, begin with Yahweh Shai, King David, and the, and the twelve, uh, uh, one hundred and forty-four thousand. We are looking to be uh, uh, the the governing body, a governing body over Israel. Okay, verse twenty-nine. But in order to obtain that, you have to go through that straight gate. All right, you got to go through the path of of uh, trouble, the path of difficulty. All right, and you got to do it alone, man. Right, so you gotta fight off that old man first, and then uh, once you conquer the old man, you can conquer the world. Okay, <clears throat> everyone that forsaken houses or brethren or sisters or father, mother or wife, or children or lands for my name's sake, who name's sake, Yahweh Shai. All right, he's our ticket. He's our ticket to uh, uh, salvation. You gotta have, you gotta have that imagination that Yahweh Shai is in front of you all the time. In front of you in your walk, in front of you when you're doing things, he's right in front of you watching because he's the only one who could save you. All right, even from the snares of death, Yahweh Shai is right there. Okay, he's always gonna be with you. Your woman is not with you, the woman, the woman uh, uh, given to vanity very fast. All right, she liked the pleasures of the world, she liked things that she could uh, see and touch. Women are are not are not given the spirit of faith, man. 
Yahweh Shemel Shai didn't give them that. He gave us. He gave the man the spirit of faith. All right. He gave the, the man the truth. Women will follow you. We gonna get women in the kingdom, but the the women in, in, on this side, they're not all women. They belong. They belong to uh, the heathen. All right. They belong to Esau. So you gotta see everybody as an Edomite who's who's not of this truth, man. Because th these Edomites, all right, is willing to kill us. Everybody, how much more everybody else who following these Edomites? They ain't with us. All right, they're against us because they're against righteousness. They're afraid of righteousness being established. But we cannot stop the Lord. All right, no one can stop the Lord from establishing uh, His kingdom. He's gonna do it, whether people like it or not. He's gonna do it violently, man. Okay. And it says, um, everyone that forsaken houses and or brethren or sisters or father or mother or wife or children or land for my name's sake shall receive a hundredfold and shall inherit everlasting life. That's what we're looking for, man. We're looking for everlasting life, never to die. All right. Sovereignty, peace. All right. We will carry families. Families on our on this side ain't our family. They're the enemy. Okay, we are we are, we are alone soldiers in this thing, man. All right, you gotta uh, gotta be a lone wolf in this truth. All right, and it says, but many that are first shall be last. All right, and the last shall be first. Okay, so we are we are the last right now. Everybody everybody uh, scorn at the men of the Lord, but the Lord Yahweh Shemesh is about to make us the first. That's in the transition that we're in right now. All right. So let's go to Second Edris, chapter seven. Second Edris, chapter seven. Verse, chapter seven, verse seven. Let's start with verse. The start of verse 6 There is also another thing A city is built and set upon a broad field And is full of good things That's the kingdom of heaven Okay That's the kingdom of heaven That's all those good things going to be in the kingdom of heaven And that city is being built up Is the house of David Okay Building our, our a foundation on, on, on spiritual things Alright Give, uh, Giving attentive To reading and praying And uh, uh or uh, fellowship with the brotherhood and, and uh, 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 giving praises to Yahweh Hashem Yahushai. Right? That's the beginning of the kingdom. Okay? So that's going to manifest into the actual kingdom. Alright? If we stay in this. Alright? That's why you got to fight the good fight of faith and lay hold on the eternal life. Secure eternal life. This is eternal life right here, man. This, this, we in a temporal life. Temporal, all right. Temp. It means temporary and short term, all right. And it says um, the entrance thereof is narrow. The entrance to what? The kingdom. The entrance to salvation is narrow, all right. So whatever that's uh, uh, offending your right hand, cut it off. If it's offending you, all right. Meaning you're gonna have to leave things in this room, man. all right. The cars you like, the 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 the, uh, the house you like, the woman you love, you gonna leave, have to leave this thing, leave things in this truth, all right. Eventually, for this for this truth, for your house, I say you gonna have to leave things in this world, okay? You have to leave it alone, all right. You came in the truth by yourself, all right. Maybe you going out in salvation, Lord willing, we have that number by ourselves. Okay. All right. Meaning, when you got this word, it was for you through Yahweh Shai. Okay. It was for you to know the mysteries of the kingdom. All right. The Israelite man, woman, follows suit. If she knows the truth, she just follows suit. Still. All right. But the point is, you're, you're alone in this. Okay. Um, the scriptures say what? Um, I want to grab him, close it out with that. 
the entrance thereof uh, in Philippians 2 and uh, 12. Uh, the entrance thereof is narrow and is set in a dangerous place to fall. Like as if there were fire on, on the right. All right. Tribulation and problem on the right. All right. On the right and hand, right hand and on the left is a deep water. Okay. Deep, I mean in perilous times. All right. Perilous times. And you just got to embrace it. And give thanks to Yahweh Shemel Shai that he's with you and not with nobody in this in this world, man. Yahweh Shemel Shai not dealing with these people. That's why they look so bugged out and don't know their their, their next day. All right, they, they don't know if their next day is gonna be promising. Okay, but people still talking about five years from now, uh, uh, this place is gonna come back and strong and uh, it's gonna be a economy. You know, they got the wrong idea. Yahweh Shai is about to destroy this place. He's about to destroy it. Uh, th this man's empire. Period. Everything that he built upon in, in, in this place is going to be destroyed. Okay? Alright? And that's a hard pill for a lot of women to swallow down. Alright? They don't understand the magnitude that Yah of destruction that Yahweh Shai is going to bring. Alright? So don't be surprised your woman leave you or don't be surprised women leave this truth because of the, the kind of pain that Yahweh Shema Shai is going to bring in that hour man alright you're going to be seeing you're going to see uh, dead babies you're going to see dead women on, on the streets man alright but you got to embrace that you got this truth you got this knowledge that the Lord bestowed upon you alright to uh, uh, uh to secure all right for your salvation your you got the ticket of salvation they don't but they was wicked and proud so that was was uh, uh the result of being wicked and proud and uh, envious all right death all right they chose the light they chose the path of death so brothers we, uh, secure this man this this is your your 24 karat gold in your hand all right and then it says and one and it says verse eight and only one, one, only path between them, both even between the fire and the water, so small that there could could but one man go up there at once. You see, only one man could go out at a time for salvation. All right, meaning the men, the men that are the hundred percent truth. All right, is gonna go up in the chariot one at a time. Not literally, but in the spiritual. Uh, uh, Content of uh, uh, very few is going to be saved, man. Very, very few. All right, and we're going to end it up with Philippians. Let me see if I can grab it. Philippians. Uh, the woman going to look back, brothers. We get our women in the kingdom when when they are when it, uh when they're renewed, being virgins. All right, all the women on this side is polluted, beginning with their mind first. And we ain't we ain't chasing beauty. We chasing that. We chasing the kingdom. All right. We chasing the kingdom. All right. Let me see. Uh, let me see if I can get it. Philippians. Philippians chapter two. I'm gonna end it there. All right. Nobody's with you in this truth. All right, or you only have the brotherhood, okay? Your family's not with you, all right? Look at every everybody as an abomination who's against this truth. You know, treasure this truth for you. No one else, man. All right? Because we all we got. Now about you, man, shine the brotherhood. That's all we got, all right? Philippians chapter 2 verse 12 Wherefore my beloved As ye have always obeyed Alright Keeping the commands of Yahweh Shem Yashai And walking in the way Yahweh Shem Yashai Want us to walk Alright Trust not in your own mind But lean, lean upon Yahweh Shem Yashai With all your mind and soul man Okay Wherefore my beloved As ye has always obeyed Alright Just have the imagination Yahweh Shai is right in front of you Each day not as in my presence only, but now much more in my absence. Why he, the Lord said that? 
the Lord said you better get more spiritual than carnal. Right? You you have the imagination. Your house is there, and he's, he he could uh, mess you up at any time if you don't follow him. Okay. But now much more in my absence, work out your own uh, salvation. Your woman can't save you. Your brother can't. Yeah, your fleshly brother can't save you. A brother can't save you. All right. Only a house shy could save you. That's why it says work out your own salvation. So every individual have to work out their own salvation with Yahweh Shai. Every single individual. If a man gets put to death, don't be uh, don't be uh, hasty or, or, or fearful about it. All right. He wasn't following Yahweh Shai, and that's point blank. Period. End of discussion. If you ain't following Yahweh Shai, you're gonna get put to death. That's how you gotta see this thing. It's for you to know the mysteries of the kingdom of heaven. Okay, but to them is not given, as Yahweh Shai said. Work out your own salvation with fear and trembling. Why? It says fear and trembling because the Lord could kill you at any time. And that's what it is, man. And the way we're gonna get delivered is it's gonna be it's gonna be uh, uh scarcely be saved. We're gonna be scarcely saved. I mean, uh, uh, we could we could get caught up in the midst of trouble. And we could die at any time. But everybody's judgment. Is going to happen for them Because they didn't follow Yahweh Shai period Every man and woman Have Have their uh, oper Have a chance uh, 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 Of getting put to death man At any given time So be thankful Yahweh Shai I gave you this truth brothers Alright Lord willing this lesson was edifying and comforting Alright let me just finish up verse 13. For it is Yahweh by Hashem Yahshah which worketh in you both to will and to do of his good pleasure. This is Yahweh by Hashem Yahshah's good pleasure to give us, give us this truth. No one else. All right? So you're alone in this thing. Just like Abraham, you was alone in the wilderness. All right? Only, only, he only had Yahweh by Hashem Yahshah, man. How could you, Sarah, you know, how could you know if Sarah was with him? Okay? She could have left any time. But the Lord gave her the spirit to stay. Okay? So, hey, man. You know, treasure this truth, brothers. You by yourself in this thing. All right? We have we have each other. All right? But we we have your how about Shema Shai. No one else, man. You're alone. All right? So, Lord willing, this lesson was edifying and comforting. I'm going to end it by giving all praises, honor, and glory to you. How about Shema Shai? By Shema Kakadash. Double honor and respect. Go to the apostles and elders of great millstone who will and teach one well leader Israel by great example to this day. Peace and salutation go to the elect, teaching and preaching the truth and his righteousness, purity and sincerity, and waiting on Yahweh Shai, whom the world only called Jesus Christ for salvation. Shalom on my stay strong in the spirit, and most out here with the salvation of Yahweh Shai. Shalom, stay strong, keep the faith. You're almost home.